Welcome back, I'm Coach Cheyenne. Today we're gonna talk about how to hit a pitch shot. Last week, I know you've watched it, we talked about how to hit a chip shot, which is when the ball goes nice and low and it rolls to the hole. Today, we're gonna show you how to hit a nice and high shot in case you have water in front of you or a bunker, you need to carry all of that and the ball goes right beside the hole with very little roll. Let's get started. Today's analogy is going to be L to L. With the roll shot, the chip shot, we did BLT, bacon, lettuce, tomato. Today we'll do L to L. What does L to L mean? We are going to grab your most lofted club. Some of you may have no idea what that means. If you have a club in your bag which says 56 or an S, a sand wedge, I would go and grab that to practice this specific shot. So what are we going to do? L to L. I am going to grab my grip. You must watch that video first on how to grab a grip. I will grab my grip. I'm nice and relaxed, always shimmying to make sure that I'm relaxed and my grip is at a 5 out of 10. So not a death grip, but a 5 out of 10 where my hands can move. So in our BLT shot last video, there was no wrist action. No, it was all like a putting stroke. Today there will be a wrist action. The first part of the L is where I take my hands over here like a handshake, which was another video I did. Then you bend your wrist and this is the first part of your L. Just like this. I hope you can see the L. My hands aren't very high. They're around my waist. Some people call this belt buckle to belt buckle shot. Some call it L. You hit the ball and then a reverse L. I hope you guys can see that. So again, I'm nice and relaxed. I'm shimmying. Pretend that the ball is right here. I would have the ball in the front of my stance because that is going to give me loft where the ball goes nice and high. Usually when you have the ball in the back of your stance, the ball goes nice and low and it runs to the hole. So I will have it in the front. I'm still going to lean left with 60% of my weight on my left side and I will go my first part which is an L. I will hit down and I will do a reverse L and I'll try and face my belly button towards the target. Let's show you all of that together. Let's do the first part of the L to L. So I have my ball, breathing, ball goes in the front of my stance, I'm leaning to the left, nice and relaxed, L to L. When you hit this shot, there won't be too much roll, it should bounce and a couple little bounces after it, okay? So not too much roll to the hole. So let's try it again. My hands, everything is gonna be relaxed and breathing. Ball goes in the front of my stance. My grip is at a five. I am leaning to my left hand side, 60%. I'm shimming to relax. And L to L. L to L. See how high that went? And not too much roll. So L to L. That was pretty close. So let's just recap. Hands are relaxed, weights on my left side. My hands come here. This is like a little baby L, right? Right by my hips, they're not super high up. So to my hips, L, hit the ball. Reverse L, and do you see how my belly button faces the target a little bit? I'm not hanging back here and just releasing my hands and waiting back here. When I do my reverse L, I turn my body and my belly button faces the target. Let's do it without the ball facing dead straight, and I'll show you all of that again. Remembering we have to practice the shot, and well, you can't just wake up one morning and go and well, you can just go and try it, but don't expect a lot out of it. So I am going to pretend like I have a ball, ball in the front, I'm relaxed, and I L, I hit down, and then I do a reverse L. See how my hands are here, aren't here, they're not out here? My hands are almost 
where the target is and so is my belly button. Everything is close to me. I'm not doing a big old swing and all kinds of movement. It's all relaxed. Let's try it again. Ball in the front. Breathing, shimmy, so I know my hands are at a grip at a five. Look at my target, my weight's on my left. My weight's on my left. L. C. Once I turn my body, look at that shot. And what's my L? Belly button, club, facing the target. I really hope this helps you. I know people get stressed out when their ball is behind the bunker or behind the lake. We panic and we're like, oh, I hope it doesn't go in the lake. I hope it doesn't go in the bunker. Don't think of any of that. We're breathing, we're relaxed, we're shimmying, and you're just thinking, you know what, L to L, and make sure you rotate your stomach and your energy towards your target. I hope this video helped as always. If you liked it, click the like button. If you have any questions, make sure to leave them in the comments below. And I know for a fact, or at least I hope, you've clicked the subscribe button. Thanks for watching.